This is the bed and breakfast we've been staying at. Um, just here is the place I've been at. You've got downstairs, you've got the kitchen and living area. Up here, you've got the bedroom. It's number one. And it's number two. The family live in this part. And then you've got a third one over here. You can have breakfast out here. There is a lot of noise going on at the moment. They're doing some uh, road out, uh, road works outside. So it's a bit noisy at the moment. But they did explain to us that they're having some work done before. So it wasn't really a shock. Um, the garden's really nice. It's very clean and well laid out. To sit out here is brilliant. But then there's some new guests that just arrived. Um, we've got a uh, really safe place as well. The gates um, locked at night and you have a key to come in. That's the, the host's um, car. He uh, very kindly dropped us off at the, uh, the train station yesterday when we were out and about. And then he's going to give us a lift. We're off to Milan today, so uh, he's going to give us a lift. This is Daisy, the house uh, dog. And she always comes here every morning she's scrambling to get inside I think she can smell our breakfast and I'll show you inside as soon as I get the door open okay so you come in through here it's a bit messy because we're getting ready to go we just had breakfast um, I haven't even finished my coffee yet so you've got that sofa there which can be turned into a bed uh, this uh, place can I would say six people could stay here quite comfortably. Uh, you've got microwave, fridge, cooker, kettle, you've got the cups and everything else. It looks out into uh, the garden. You've got somewhere to sit there. There's also one you can see in the beginning the, the table over there. You've got uh, a PC if you wanted to use it. The Wi-Fi here is fantastic, really fast because I guess the router sets must be separate to the other house. And the stairs lead upstairs to the bedroom area. This the... I'm just packing up now, we're, we're actually quite late. Check out here is at 10.30. Um, we thought it was 12, it was our fault, we didn't really check. Um, but the host has been really nice and uh, said uh, to us not to rush. So you've got the two beds here. And then you have this one here. So, like I said, six people could quite easily sleep here. You've got one here, two people there, and another one downstairs. So, if you've got a couple. Again, view of the uh, the garden. And the bathroom's just through there. I'll show you that. Now. It's a really nice bathroom. You've got a TV there. The ceiling's nice beams on the ceiling. But an absolutely fantastic place. They um, they have a phone here, so when you're ready for breakfast, you just call them, and they will bring breakfast to the room. So you don't even have to go out. And it's a really nice Italian breakfast. It's Lovely uh, lemon cake. You can see the we'll have we had breakfast here. It, you bring them up, and within ten minutes uh, you can have uh, breakfast. Uh, they will do a um, continental style breakfast, an English breakfast. So wh whichever you want, you just, I guess you just have to tell them beforehand. And the coffee here is amazing. So. This is uh, the place. Um, I can't recommend it highly enough. It is a fantastic place. We actually was we wanted to stay an, another day. We've been here for two days, um, but they're, they're fully booked, and it's not even the height season. So, just goes to show um, how uh, how popular this place is. If you're travelling through Italy and you're up in this area to stay here for a few days, is brilliant. So, check check out the uh, the website. I'll put a link uh, below.